Today uh, I am blessed with this little 51 Chevy. It's a new customer. The guy that built it had to do everything himself and he wasn't necessarily the best painter in the world. He did a pretty good job, but then he came back to make some blends and uh, things didn't match up quite right. And although it looks good from 50 feet, it don't look good from 20 feet. So we're gonna try to make it at least look good from two or three feet. There's a whole lot of sanding going on. And sanding ain't the funnest thing in the world, so you just crank up the jams and go with it. A lot, of, a lot of vinyl guys will say, well, you're crazy dealing with paint, man. Look how dirty you get. Look at all this paint on your hands. Look at that noxic, no, noxious fumes you got, it got to uh, breathe. I said, well, yeah, there's a downside to everything. Uh, you know, as a sign man wearing different hats and different uh, techniques, it's all good. Although we are, we're just sign men in, in, in general, I'm really a trick paint artist. My thing is, is trick paint like this, uh, custom murals with the airbrush, pinstriping. Uh, uh, we also make signs. Uh, uh, truck lettering is a major, 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 major part of my business. And I've always really liked that part of the trade more than anything else. You know, I'm at a truck shop. Uh, you know, I only live a mile from here, so, so I pretty much grew up and landed right at the only truck shop in my neighborhood. Nowadays, if I'm going to do a piece of artwork, I'll, I'll airbrush or whatever, however technique I want to do to make a piece of artwork, and then uh, we'll take a digital photo of it, uh, send it into the sign making program, and I might come up with something like Jack the Rapper there, which is my new uh, shop logo uh, to promote uh, vinyl work. I would say the, the trade economically is okay, but I'm glad I know how to paint and do custom work because the vinyl end of the trade isn't paying very good. Not anything that, that you're gonna go to school and learn at your community college or even at your senior college. I really enjoy the hand painting end of things because in order to, to do artwork, you have to calm yourself down. You gotta get your frame of mind right you gotta find that happy spot, and you paint. Now, when something's hand lettered, it's considered art, because it takes so long to get, get hand lettering skills built up. 